know, a lot of what we tend to do with sports is number one, we create narratives. And number two, we live in fantasy world. A lot of what we discuss as fans will never happen. Some of these narratives that we create are just things that we've envisioned in our head. Some true, some probably not, not even true, to be honest with you. But narratives are a real thing. And a big part of people's legacy are narratives. How things have shaped for them in their careers. The luck that they've had can sometimes add to a narrative, right? I bring all that up to say this. There is a narrative being created in Milwaukee right now. And there is a pathway for a Greek freak by the name of Giannis Antetokounmpo to be one of the 10 to 12 greatest players to ever play this game. Just look how the stars have aligned. Look around. See, the Brooklyn Nets last year added James Harden to a crop that already had Kevin Durant and we think Kyrie Irving. Look at the Los Angeles Lakers last offseason. They added Russell Westbrook to a crop that already had LeBron James and Anthony Davis. Look around the league. Look at all the movement. Teams fluttering, trying to find ways to create things that probably not even there. The Chicago Bulls and added Lonzo, DeMar DeRozan to a nucleus that already had Zach Levine, Nikola Vucevic. Look at the Miami Heat. They added Kyle Lowry to a team that just went to the finals about a year and some change ago. Look around the league. Teams are stacking up, stacking the decks to go after a championship. And then go over to Milwaukee, fresh off of their championship, their ring. NBA Finals run. Giannis dropped 50 and 14 in a closeout game six. With two guys in which we look at them as B-level players in this league. Not A's, but great B's. And Chris Middleton and Drew Holiday. Giannis, the only superstar on that team. Already two MVPs in his cabinet. One defensive player of the year. One finals MVP at his disposal. 1-0 and in the NBA Finals. By the way, that's something that Kevin Durant didn't do. That's something that LeBron James didn't do. Look at what the Milwaukee Bucks did or watch this, watch what they didn't do. They just kind of sat back, stood packed, signed a couple of their guys back, even lost a couple guys like P.J. Tucker. But overall, they're bringing back the same group that just won a championship a couple months ago. Giannis feels as if, though, as long as he and his team are healthy, they'll do it again. That's the narrative. If Giannis is able to go back-to-back -back this year, somehow win another NBA League MVP, go along with another NBA Finals MVP, you tell me he wouldn't be already one of the 15 greatest basketball players of all time before the age of 30. You tell me. Two championships, Finals MVPs, Defensive Player of the Year. Go look at the history of this game and tell me who had a resume as great as Giannis. If he wins another championship this year and another MVP in a regular season, he's always in the contention for it. He didn't have to go out and add other all-stars. See, that's how you get the old guys, the, the Shaquille O'Neal's and the Charles Barkley's of the world. They'll respect that. Chris Middleton and Drew Holiday, they're, they're guys that are really great at certain things. but We wouldn't consider them great players. Giannis was like, nah, I like my group. I like what we got. Let them other dudes go add Russell Westbrook and James Harden. I'm cool with what I got. That is a narrative. That is how you create a GOAT convo. Giannis Antetokounmpo sat back and watched KD and LeBron's teams panic. They went and added more help because of guys like Anthony Davis and Kyrie Irving unfortunately being unreliable for their own reasons. And Giannis is like, I like what I got. You ain't got no A-level players next to me but i also don't got no a level egos i got two humble dudes in drew holiday and chris middleton and they'll get the job done as long as i'm there to do my part on a bad knee i won a championship i'm telling y'all there's a tim duncan like legacy being created in milwaukee for Giannis Antetokounmpo. just sit and pack and stand with what he's got 